Moon soil, the ultimate goal of the Chang'e 5 mission. Before this, the former Soviet Union had carried out three moon soil collection missions, acquiring over 300 grams of samples. The unmanned Chang'e 5 aims to collect about 2,000 grams of moon soil. How will it complete such a feat? After the lander touches down, it turns into an excavator. It will dig deep to collect lunar rocks and will also collect a soil sample from the surface. This will be done by a mechanical arm. Reach down, shovel, collect, transfer, and store in the primary sealed compartment. The surface sample collection is successful, but another challenge awaits the drilling. On Earth, we normally use different drills for different environments, but it's not possible to bring so many tools to the moon. So, we have to design a universal drill that can be used in various situations. A spiral-shaped hollow drill emerged as the eventual winner. The moon soil directly enters a soft bag attached to the drill pipe as it's being collected. The bag has another ingenious design. It envelops the pipe like long stockings and then, as the sample enters the bag, the drill spins and flips it inwards. After it's sealed, the bag enters a packaging device where it is coiled up like a sausage before being put into the compartment. Amazingly, this series of complicated maneuvers is not operated by ground control. With only three hours for the samples to be collected, they must let the computer make its own decisions in order to improve efficiency. Simulation experiments carried out on Earth resulted in an operating program for this purpose. <laughs> Using massive amounts of data obtained through thousands of experiments, the engineers integrated countless solutions and programmed them into the software. When collecting samples on the moon, just one command allows the computer to work autonomously as it's been programmed to. In 1976, the USSR carried out its third and final moon soil collecting mission. 44 years on, mankind is once again pushing the limits, collecting about 2,000 grams of moon sample. But this time, we didn't just obtain moon soil. We also made a great leap in the field of science and technology.